Here I go! Oh, this one. So, yep, Captain Toadette is back. Performing for you. She's the first member of the Toadette crew. The Toadette crew sounds like a place that you go to buy clothes. Like J. Crew. Yeah, those guys are also from 3D World. I don't know why I would even need to bring that up, because of course they are. Everything in this game is from 3D World. A pretty little... the rainbow. I never really liked this song, though, if I'm being completely honest. I don't like the weird honks and horns that they put in it. Although I do like the dun 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 dun. I mean, you know, find me a Mario game with a bad soundtrack and I would be shocked, but there's just certain aspects of some songs that don't quite... Oh, well, I got stuck on that. Don't uh, grab me the, the right way, and I took too long. Oof. I just got hit by that guy. He was almost a chill sandwich. I think there's something up here, isn't there? Am I right or wrong? There's something on one of these. Uh, maybe it's on the other side? I know that there's a secret spooky thing on one of these tree trunks. I mean, there's that, obviously, but... I guess I'm remembering wrong. I guess it was just the gem. But why would that be? I'm gonna have to look over there. Or maybe. Is that... I don't know. Maybe I'm just wrong. I mean, I someone's. I've got to be wrong sometimes. But I'm just not used to being wrong. Whoa! That shot me up so much. I swear to God, there's something in here. I guess I'm misremembering. Let's probably like find a mushroom and there's like a dumb mushroom there. Oh yeah! And that was the level where uh, I lost my mind somehow. Yeah, I knew it. I knew there was a hole. I'll find you. I knew it. What did I say? And there it was. Bitty Bud Snow Stroll. Oh, this one. Yeah, this is like I, I keep saying that episode three has so many of the most fun, like unique levels in here. The deal with this one is that the Bitty Buds are showing you where to go. So I kind of already screwed up. But I guess if I go down, that's not the worst thing, because I think there's stuff that I need down here. Where's that? That's probably, that probably yeah, brings me back up. Alright. Hopefully those guys don't hurt me. And those guys are called fuzzies. I had to look it up, but that's what they're called. And I knew it. I'm never wrong when it comes to Mario enemy names. Ow. I am wrong on my timing sometimes. But again, even the most perfect man can be wrong sometimes. And that just proves that uh, I'm not always perfect. Even though I know that's heartbreaking to hear. Oh, that was wrong. I knew that was there. I just wanted to trap it, you know? I didn't want that panel to uh, feel the superiority over me. Ooh, boy. Can you guys, like... Thank you. Oh, did they go this way? Yeah, of course they did. But I gotta go this way. See, I'm pretty much like a Captain Toad Master. Can I fall off there? I don't want to test that. Ooh, quickly, go, go, go! 
Alright, well, I could follow the path here, but... It doesn't really... I'm shocked that touching it with the, uh, the pad here doesn't do anything. I mean, you can see that I'm tracing lines on there. Is she cold or scared? They're pretty much the same emotions, right? Well, cold isn't an emotion. <laughs> Wait, hold on, what am I doing? Where am I supposed to be? You are a son of a bitch. Watch this, I don't need these bitty buds. Dead. At least they don't put you in the fuzzy's way. Can I walk it diagonally? I can. And there you go, that's the end of the level. I didn't screw up once, twice, I, I didn't screw up at all. I screwed up zero times. You know me, the consummate Captain Toad professional. Always know what I'm doing. Didn't break any tiles. That is very easy. I did actually have a little mini freak out there at the end. I was like, wait a minute, how, do, how am I supposed to get down if I can't break anything? Oh, that's either a mummy me or just another stupid mini game. And it's just coins. Okay. Do Toadettes change, or do I get the same ones as Captain Toad? Oh no, I just am Captain Toad, alright. Yeah, give me that. What is this one? Is this the spinny, roundy one? Nope, this is a nightmare. Again, anything that reminds me of, um... Champion's Road in Super Mario 3D World, not good. Please don't. I... what was it, like, two coins that I was missing? That's a load of malarkey. Well, I do think that was the best I did, right? I still don't know what the coins do. Like, obviously, I understand that they, uh... They're used for lives, but I, I don't... I, I don't know why I want to collect them. This level's a pain in my dick. Oh, man. Well, I guess I could have held him? No, but I do have to drop down and kill him, so... It'll be fine. I kill him. I kill him now. He's unarmed. I can't... Do it. Do it. This is not where I want to be. But it does look like I need a... Pickaxe. Right? How do I break those? Okay, you, sir, have been bonked. I can't climb up there. Right, I guess I've got to do this. These are more fresh in my mind, but it doesn't mean I still remember everything. I, I, there is a, a small part of my brain that, you know, well, my brain's already pretty small, so it's a very tiny part of my brain where I just have a lot of knowledge about Captain Toad. Oh, that's how I do that. Gotcha. So now... I still need to drop down. Break this, you jerk. Do something useful for once in your life. Oh no. Wait, how do I get up there? I don't think I can now. This better give me something good. Did I miss my opportunity to get that? I probably did. Um, Alright, you know what? Here we go. Die. I'm gonna kill myself. When things look grim, uh, kill yourself. That's my uh, piece of advice. Alright. There we go. And now I'm gonna die again. Because uh, suicide is the easy way out. There we go. Now we can just do everything normally. Uh, I guess I can kill this guy, but I don't really need to yet. Might as well just do it since I'm here. What was in here? That was a mushroom, I don't care. 
I guess I could have gotten that mushroom and not... Oh well. No, because, yeah, I could have. Oh well. There's a dead toadette on my hands and it's... Doesn't feel good. Yeah, that is so... Picky, it feels like it's... Not good. Why was there a clown horn there? I think more games should incorporate clown horns into their uh, soundtracks. Or just sound effects. That wasn't even part of the soundtrack. I think this one, yeah, you have to do this. Can we... Alright, this one's so annoying. Because of the way that you gotta do it. Oh no. This is why this level's such a pain, is because it's really long. It's longer than a lot of the other ones. But it's, um, you know, just stupid. You keep dying, so you have to do it all over again, and it's, it's longer than most levels. I guess I can hold this guy, but it's still kind of annoying. Alright, there we go. I fall in the hole. Man, my commentary is just on point here, isn't it? Okay, the flood, the hole. Alright, I literally, I can't even... The the extra thing is over here. I think there's another golden mushroom hidden patch over there. Which means I gotta do the level again. And that's why this level is my favorite in the entire game. At least I don't have to deal with getting the uh, gem. So, what I was supposed to have done here is just walk over here, and there's a patch. Oh, I, I preemptively picked the patch. That was a preemptive pick patch. Nope, damn it. It was a preemptive patch pick. 